Oh, this is my new 98 Toyota Camry I got. I traded my Integra and then uh, and then 3700 cash for this. Not bad. Got a nice stereo system. I just need an antenna in the back. It's got a little little dings here and there, but nothing serious. It runs real smooth. Um, it's got 176,000 miles on it, but you know these cars last to like 350,000 if you take good maintenance. And they've been serviced. It's been in the family for the whole time. It's two people in the family that owned it. So um, it's got a nice little shine still. Uh, there's some things I could uh, replace. Like my brother works at the Toyota dealership so I can get the new bumper or whatever and match the color or whatever there for cheaper than I normally would and then the interior is really good. Let's see, pretty clean, pretty clean. I gotta get a, I have a CD deck with the remote so I'm gonna get that installed. I know a buddy that works at Fry's so hopefully I can get it there done cheap. And then, uh, yeah, I think I did good. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Actually, I'll open up the hood and show you how clean the engine is, too. Look at the grill of the Camry. I don't care what anybody says, Camrys are G-Rides. Okay. Let's see if I can do it. Oh, I can do it with one hand, wow. getting skilled at this Let's see new battery new hose fairly new hoses new alternator was put in everything you could look get to basically which is nice about this car it's a 2.2 liter 33 miles per gallon that's why I got it got to think about money man when it comes to driving it how much it's gonna suck up got fairly new tires um, yes, I put my seat back, <laughs> and that's how I stay comfortable, and it has that little armrest right there, it's kind of like a little luxury car in a way, you know, a little mob shot, still like a grandma car though, the way it was treated, it was in one family the whole time, been maintenance, I got the Carfax on it, I'm probably going to tint the windows, put in a stereo system, and just leave it like that, that's all I need. And the place that I got it from, on, I found on Craigslist, they also they sell cars, but they also work through the DMV, so you don't have to go to the DMV. They take care of it all right there. So tomorrow I'm going to Fairfield to uh, with him to go pick up that car and then bring it back for them. So that's a good deal. Worked out. I'm happy. Maybe show you guys the trunk too. But yeah, motor's not bad. Everything's pretty well. No, no leaks. It has AC. I think I uh, worked a deal because they wanted four at first for it. And I said, I don't have four, but I'll give them. And I said I only had 35 cash, but I had I gave them an extra two. I came out my pocket, but I think all in all, it's, it's this in my situation, this is what I need. And the Mustang I really liked, the 70 Mustang, but it's too much on gas, too much on maintenance. You know? this you know I just get in the car and go don't have to wait for it to warm up you know how old schools are and I also have floor mats which I am about to put in there and the seats obviously go back if you need to fold them back if I have to move or something like that they're gonna be sending me my plates so that's it's basically my car my car my day and guess what the tags uh, I think they expire next year or whatever in March which is my birthday so that's kind of cool too uh, I get to with my birthday money it's gonna go towards registration <laughs> or birthday to myself anyways because I know it's gonna, I'm gonna be coming out the pocket just want to say thanks for watching rich dog 707 channel or rich 707 dog or however the hell I put it um, that's my car